Tonight, new information raises even more questions about Nashville Mayor Megan Barry, her, her need for police security that you paid for. It follows the mayor's admission last week of a two year affair with the head of her security detail. News Channel 5's chief investigative reporter Phil Williams is here with the information just released by the mayor's office. Phil. Yeah, it was just in the last two hours. The mayor's office released new details about the mayor's travel and her use of security in hopes of convincing the public that she did not abuse taxpayer money. It follows a day that she spent appealing to a higher authority. We just pray God for this mayor, her family, the family of all who are involved. We just pray God that you would just bring about a level of healing. Now, Mayor Barry spent her morning yesterday visiting two African-American churches, praying for the community's forgiveness. At the same time, her staff was gathering evidence to document her travel and the time spent with Police Sergeant Rob Forrest during their two-year affair. Now, here are the highlights of what we're seeing. The documents show that during the first year of her administration, Barry traveled alone to Boston, New York, Washington, D.C., Oklahoma City, and Phoenix. There were other trips to Los Angeles, for example, where she traveled with other staff members and no security. Her first out of state trip with Forrest, as well as other city officials, was to Minneapolis in April 2016. But in 2017, for the first time, Barry and Forrest started traveling alone together when they took nine trips, including to Athens, Greece, and Paris, France. Now, in a statement, the mayor's office says that was because of security needs, which is what she told us last week. The detailed security policy is set by the police department and they they say I have to travel with security. It's their decision or your decision? It's their decision. And, and can you say, no thanks, I, I don't need security on this trip? You know, I take the advice of, of the police and say, what, you're the experts, what do I need? Now, meanwhile, we're learning a lot more about Rob Forrest's overtime that you paid for. It turns out the time he spent with Mayor Barry made him the second highest paid person in the Metro Police Department. In fiscal year 2017, Chief Steve Anderson made the most, earning just over $200,000 according to Metro government records. But Forrest was second. With overtime, he got paid $158,000. That was more than the head of internal affairs who earned one forty-nine, dollars and the three deputy chiefs, they each made $147,000. Meanwhile, the TBI investigation continues. Metro Police spokesperson Don Aaron confirms that Sergeant Forrest's police-issued smartphone has now been turned over to the TBI. Presumably, investigators will be looking for text messages and other evidence. Rory.